the Homer software has a unique paradigm where we have embedded a production cost simulation engine within an optimization algorithm and packaged that in a decision analytic framework to identify sensitivities and robust solutions. This is illustrated by this picture. From a programming perspective, it is a set of nested for loops. The innermost loop dispatches generation and manages storage to meet the load in every simulation time steps. Those time steps are typically hours, but can be as short as one minute. It does that for an entire year to calculate fuel consumption, run times, maintenance requirements, and operating costs. It then optimizes the design by simulating hundreds or thousands of different design configurations and ranking them by net present cost or other criteria. That identifies what is best for a particular scenario. In Homer, we call these scenarios sensitivity cases. They represent the results of individual optimizations. A sensitivity analysis in Homer is a set of many optimizations that Homer will perform in a single run when you hit calculate. This paradigm is reflected in the way Homer displays results. In the results view, with the tabular radio button selected, the sensitivity results are at the top and the optimization results are at the bottom. Each row of the sensitivity results table is a sensitivity case. The sensitivity results table displays the least cost system for each optimization. By clicking on a specific row and highlighting it, you are selecting which sensitivity case to display in the optimization table in the lower portion of the page. Then by double clicking on the row in the optimization table, you, you bring up a new window with all the simulation results for that particular system design. At the bottom of the simulation results window, there are buttons to access a variety of ways to view the time series data. This is res the result of the energy balances for each time step in the chronological simulation. Each of these tables is described in more detail in a later video. The purpose of this video was just to explain Homer's paradigm, the different layers of data, and how they relate to each other. Thank you for watching the Homer Software's training series. We are here to help you. If you are a trial user, please contact us at support at homerenergy.com for more information on how to become a licensed user. We have additional training available for our licensed users. Visit gethomertraining.com to learn more.